Bonjour mon petit, it is I, the fabulous Trees, back with a new video. And in today's video, I have not one, not two, not even three, nope, not four, but five. Wait, you already saw that in the title. You knew, you knew, you knew this already. Mm. Anyway, I'm gonna show you five different ways that you can spice up your fro if you get a little, you know what I'm saying, tired of it, you wanna change it up a little bit, whatever I'm saying. We got some funky, edgy stuff, we got a little classy, you know what I mean, you know what I'm saying? I think it's classy. Saying we even got some regular, old regular stuff. So, if you wanna see how I do what I do and how you could do it too, then keep on watching and I will show you a thing or two or five. Anyway, I'll catch you on the other side. Okay, so you guys remember that fabulous fro from last week? Well, this is it two days later. It's literally two days later. Um, and I have not retwisted my hair at night just so, so it could stay that that stretched uh, no curl pattern whatever so and it's been really humid in New York it's been raining every other day whatever um, so this is what it looks like now um, so now we're gonna do new things to it the first thing we're gonna do is so freaking simple like if you just want to spice up your fro and switch it up change it up all we're gonna do is stick a part in the side and all you need to do for that, girl, I, I don't never know what my stuff is. I should just have it all right in front of me, you know, nice and laid out, all neat and stuff. But I don't. I don't. But I, I'm trying to do that right now. This, this is me putting my things in front of me. Put this in front of me, too. Okay. So, what you want to do, and remember, my hair is dirty. This is only two days later. I have not washed my hair yet. So what you're gonna do? So you're going to just push your hair up and back and out of the way, out of your face. It's standing up now. And I'm sorry, all of my fro does not fit in the frame. I'm, I'm sorry. But all you're gonna do is whichever side you feel comfortable, you're gonna make a side part. And you're gonna take it back kind of far Yeah, that looks good. And then you're just gonna fluff it out. I actually want it, I think I want it a little deeper. And be careful when you're separating your hair. You are not trying to break your hair. And then you're just gonna fluff it. Take your pick, fluff it so that it still stands. And boom, now you've added a little edge to your fro, you know what I'm saying? Now you got a little edgy situation going on. God, I wish all of this fit in the freaking, oh, I'm trying, let me see if I can scooch down. <laughs> okay, so this is what you got going on. And this style ain't for everybody. I would definitely wear this. I might wear this tomorrow, to be honest. Um, okay, so <laughs> that's look one. Okay, so for style number two, we're gonna get a little more, you know, traditional, traditional. And you're just going to, you're going to just separate the back of your hair from the front of your hair. Oh, make sure that you're doing this on moisturized hair. You don't wanna be doing this on like OD dry hair because pulling your hair apart like this could potentially be damaging if your hair is not moisturized. But if you watched my fro video, then you already know how to moisturize your hair. And if you didn't, I'm going to link it right there. Yeah, right there. I think that drop down thing comes right there. And this part doesn't have to be straight because ain't nobody gonna see it. You just wanna make sure that you have enough hair in the front and enough hair in the back. And you're going to gather your hair up. And get the back hair out the way. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got to, we got to get all that out the way, girl. And then you're gonna grab a hair tie. All right, so you're gonna grab the front of your hair up. 
and just adjust it so that it's on top of your head and not like in the front of your head. So you just wanna fluff this out. And I took my thing down before I started taping and, and forgot. So <laughs> when you take this down, all you want to do is split this into two. And the part, again, does not have to be perfect. If you want to make it like decent, you can. But if you have as much hair as I do, it's going to cover that anyway. And all you're going to do is take that one puff and put it into two. If I can find my other hair tie. Okay, I found it. We're gonna do two giant puffs. So see, like I said, it was gonna cover it in T ways. Again, do what you're gonna do with the back, fluff it out, fluff it out. Okay, so for style number, what style are we on? Three? Four. four, I think we're on four. So for style number four, we're gonna do a little regular every day, you know what I mean, you know what I'm saying? And we're just gonna take all of our hair up and put it on the top of our heads. So you're going to need a little bit of moisture for this. So. Grab your moisturizer of choice. I'm using my usual uh, Maui Moisture joint. And um, I gotta buy some more of this. I'm actually running out. And you're going to rub that into your hands, smooth up the back of your head. And you're just gonna start tugging and pulling everything forward. Forward, 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 forward. Although, I could do something like this. This is cute. Y'all think this is cute? I think this is cute, especially with my street. Ew, that's kind of cute. But that's not what we're doing. So you want to grab your hair up. Am I yelling? I feel like I'm hollering. If I'm hollering, I need y'all to tell me. Tree, stop hollering. What you hollering for? You're just going to do a whole bunch of gathering. We're just going to gather. Then you're going to grab your trusty, dusty, oh girl, <laughs> what is this brought of Frankenstein? I got come on that one. Anywho, you're going to grab your string. If you have a stretched out hair tie, I like to use a string because my hair does not do well in ponytails. Like with all of it together, my hair does not, it, 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 it don't function well like that. So I'm going to tie my string around the back of my head and I'm going to slide it up and tighten. But you're just gonna tighten it. And what I like about ties is that it gives you control over how tight or how loose your thing is. And I'm just going to tie this. I'm just gonna cross it over and tie it. I'm not even gonna like loop it or knot it or anything. And it's under there and it is secure, honey. Now again, I apologize that all of this does not fit in the frame. Hold on, let me get down. Let me get down for y'all. Okay. <laughs> and you're just going to shape and fluff. Shape and fluff. Just make sure that it's the shape that you want. You know what I'm saying? Like that's, that's what's important about this. Shape is important. So, okay, so this is it. Is it too much? Is it a crime? Are you putting in too much time? Is it a problem? You're not mine. I guess the music. Okay, so for the last, last, the last style. So <laughs> okay, it's 3.23 in the morning and I am delirious, okay? So for the last style, you are going to part out a section of hair so I already have this part and actually I do want to clean it up because you're going to see the part now. 
See, so when you get a knot, do not try and rip through it. Take your time and take that knot out. You know what? Whatever, because this ain't even going to be around long. Me and my dandruff. I'm going to wash my hair this week, y'all. I promise. All right. So you're going to just separate out a piece from the front. You're going to separate out another piece from the front. And you're going to just put this piece out of the way. Now again, you're going to pull and tug and tug and pull and pull and tug and tug and pull. You see where, you see where we're going with this? So now you want to grab your hair tie. If I know where I put my, yo, I'm so discombobulated right now. Like I don't, I don't know anything. I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. This time it makes more sense to tie it around the top. So you're gonna pull and tighten. And when you get it as tight as you want it, because we're doing a like low to medium height puff, you're going to bring it around and just tie it in the back. And then you're gonna take out this front section. And this is where it gets fun. You can do whatever the F you want to do with the front section. You can make it into some bangs. You know, you could do something funky with it, put it off to the side or whatever. You know, you could, you could do a whole bunch of stuff with this. But what we're doing, the reason why we split it down the middle is we're going to make this into a low, a low puff, yeah. So you're going to grab one side section and you can do this with gel. Gel will make this a lot sleeker, but I honestly am not here for that today. But you're gonna take your section and pull it to the back of your head. Okay, just like that. And then you're gonna grab a big old bobby pin and pin said hair into place. If I can get it open. And then you're gonna take the other side and do the exact same thing. And if your hair doesn't go all the way to the back, just pull it to the back as far as you can. That's the point. So now you have yourself a lovely low puff and you didn't have to hurt yourself to get it. And this one, you could dress it up, you know what I'm saying? You could put a little flower in your hair if you want to, or whatever, you know. Make it classy, make it cute. Make it cute and classy, right? Never listen to my heart. Pull it apart again. Okay guys, so that brings us to the end of another tutorial with Treats. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, please make sure you give me a big old thumbs up. I would greatly, 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 greatly appreciate it. I enjoyed making this video for you guys so much. So I really, really, really hope you did hope you did enjoy it. Subscribe to my channel. If you have not, make sure you are subscribed. And if you're already subscribed, then make sure your notifications are on because your girl is back. I'm all the way back. I'm back like I never left. And I'm dropping these videos for you guys. Make sure you're following me on social media too, especially Instagram, because that's where I am all the time. At call me underscore Trees. Same name across the board. If you're trying to find your girl, you're going to find me. Okay, that's all there is to say. And there is no more except, as always. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you, 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 love you so much. And I will catch you in the next video. Bye. Ha <laughs>